recently, I know you've been spending a little bit of extra time or more time in the advisor community, observing different advisor behaviors, being in tune with some of the conversations taking place in the advisor community. And I'd love to know, top of mind, what has stuck out to you lately? Uh, what's caught your attention, good, bad, or indifferent? And uh, any learnings that you'd like to share with uh, our wonderful Good Till Cancelled audience? I would say, you know, largely it's a very broken like marketing machine that exists for most financial advisors that exist. I think for some reason, financial advisors have tried to turn, you know, LinkedIn into in, into Facebook and they've done it in a really weird way that I think is harmful to the brand. And, you know, James Pollard, who is a advisor marketing guy, you know, he, he's made a really good point that I've really taken home is that in the financial advisor, financial planning marketplace, it's one of the most distrusted industries in the world, right? So I think the most important part about any of your social media presence, it should really be about building credibility, building rapport, building trust. And you got to be really careful about putting material out into the world that might make you look a little bit like a clown. We're in an industry that is so distrusted to begin with that you have to be so careful. I'm not saying you have to be super buttoned up all the time and you can't have fun and you have to wear the three-piece suit, but I, I think it's a really dangerous trend that some people are going down. You're the marketing guru, what do you think? That's just an observation that I have. I've always run, boy, I love what you just said. <laughs> not that I'm a guru, <laughs> the other part. I've always loved or always run with this idea of like, be careful of, you know, the impression you're giving to the world. You, you need, you're, you're managing people's money. Like this is what they trade their time for. This is very important to them. Be careful in the reputation you're building. I've never looked at it from that angle. And I'm going to run with that now as a, as a lead into the goofy part, which is what you shared about with it. Pollard shared, which is you're right. You're starting almost underwater and why further anchor yourself and the industry and the and the the perception by not showing people what you're capable of the seriousness that you apply to this whole thing how important it is to you and them and boy that that's a fantastic point you made